and welcome to Retro Roulette, the show that asked the question, "Why, oh, where, oh, where has my little dog gone? I'm your host, Michael Riley. With me is Jason Amherst. hi all. And in 64 times. It's the 64. And we have no dump cards left, so we're going to have to play this. Oh boy. It's it's the not NBA jam. Pretty sure that was the NBA showtime theme. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken, uh, this was still released in arcades at the time. Yeah, okay. Yeah, this is still two on two like jam. Okay. This would be good. Yeah, this will be okay. Better than uh, what was released under the jam game, uh, jam name. This is the NBA on NBC. There's the song I was just humming. Yeah. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Uh, and I don't need to do that. Uh, let me see. Any any cheats? Are there any any cheats? Uh, let's see. Hidden characters. Oh. Uh, you have to enter a name and a pin. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Hi, Alan Iverson. Uh, the, the Bulls mascot. Jason, whoever Jason is. Uh, it's you. Nets mascot. Uh, mascot. Don't freeze Pacers on me. Mascot. Don't freeze on me. Uh, John Hay. The hey. Hornets mascot. The Hawks mascot. Grinch? I'm wondering if that is the Grinch. Mr. Grinch? I don't know. You want to be the Grinch? Guido? <laughs> Raptor? I I'm, I'm just looking at the list of characters here. Old Man? <laughs> Lives in Cloud? Or yells at Cloud, rather? <laughs> How, how about Guido? Is it how the Guidos are Gucci? <laughs> That's what I was thinking. Oh, with the spin. Uh, 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 we we could we could just be uh, on the safe side. Go with the Bulls mascot. We know what the Bulls mascot looks like. Okay. So on the name entry screen, enter. Uh, Benny with the pin number 0503. This is the NBA on NBC. What is it? Benny. Shit, shit. How do I go back? And then zero five zero three. Cool. Um, yeah, there there are codes, but you got to press like certain buttons in a certain order on the matchup screen. The Chicago Bulls take on the Vancouver Grizzlies. Oh shit. For example, uh, there's there's uh, no player arrows, midway uniform, infant turbo, big heads, away uniform. 
<laughs> there we go. Benny the Bull. This is the matchup everyone's been waiting for. With the off-balance runner. He'll try it again. He missed again. And he pumping way above the ring. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, uh, for example, infinite turbo on the matchup screen. Turbo four times, jump once, pass once, up. With the jumper, slice it up for two. Nice. Just glad this is working. Yeah, same. Ah. Uh. Ah. Nice. Nice. With the off balance runner. Takes off. Yeah. Yeah. Jim it in your face, you fuck. Got to fuck. Nothing but nylon. There is one minute left. Fires it from long range. Boom. Three points. Okay, this is great. Oh, oh shit! Freaking goaltending! Oh god, why did I do that? Time is winding down. Yeah, good job. Don't matter. So, none of this matters. <laughs> it's all all about the Bulls, baby. The Bulls lead is two. At the horn. No. Ah. Okay. Well, that's so far so good. Not bad so far. Now, some of the other, uh, some of the other uh, codes: snow mode, swamp fog mode, tiny heads, tiny players. Fancy footwork. Oh shit! Oh, shot clock. Oh. Oh, you can shut off goaltending with a code. You bitch. Don't touch him, you'll burn your fingers. This guy is on fire. He shoots. And battles out the flame. Ugh. Launches the flame. God damn it. That that actually might be the uh the best code. Clearly. Easiest code too. Turbo five times, shoot five times, pass five times, left. Oh, that was a dumb play. Give me the ball. Three points. All right. Ah, oh, damn it. I blocked oh. it and he still got it back. Why the fuck? Holy shit! Holy shit! <laughs> oh, that was sick. That was so fucking amazing. That was sick as shit. I'm putting up the threes tonight, man. Holy I shit. I know, right? Holy crap. All right. It's all right. I'll get back into it. Boom! Another three. It could be... oh, 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 up by man. one and a half. This is a good game of basketball right here, motherfucker. Damn. Good game of basketball? That's not what I said. <laughs> That's what it sounded like. Sure. We'll go with basketball. <laughs> let's let's pull in somebody else. Uh, him. So I'm obviously going to stay Benny because he was the secret character. All right. Give me the ball. 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 What the hell was I on that? There we go. All right. Nice pump fake. Oh, that was a brick. That was also a brick. Thank you. Thank you, Andrew Lang. 
get absolutely fucked. Oh! Oh! A long two. It is all tied up. Let's one go. Oh man, oh man. Put it up by three. Nice. Yes. Up by one. Up by one again. Oh shit. From half court, why did I do oh that? Oh my god. It's okay, I got it back. I got it back. Nice! Nice. Okay, alright. Dang. Uh, put it in. No. How is that not goaltending? Ah, uh, all right. They're up by one. It's only one point. It's only one point. Still good. Still good. It's just a little airborne. It's still good. It's still good. <laughs> it's God, Dad. It Boom! He'll take the three. I gotta start putting. I gotta start putting in threes again. Oh three. fuck off! From downtown. Okay. Here we go. Jesus Christ. Yeah, this is where the AI is getting Why? skewed. No. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Oh, thank God I got the ball right back. Damn it. All right, all right. We're losing it. We're losing it. Damn it. Ah, don't worry about it. It's just the AI. It's incredibly cheaty against the Bulls. They got us. Yeah. Want to do a different character? Uh, sure. Like a different mascot? We got Timberwolves. We got Rockets. We got uh, Nuggets. Pacers. Hornets, Hawks. Uh, let's go. Uh, what's the special character in the Pacers? Uh, I have no clue, but All right. uh, Boomer. Alright, what's this, the code for that? Boomer, you said? Boomer 0604. And the team is the Pacers. Yep. Boomer. Uh. Oh, yeah, if you want no goaltending, uh, hit turbo five times, shoot five oh, times, shit. pass five times, and then left. The Los Angeles Clippers. I. Okay. Yeah. I don't think I don't, I, think, I don't think I did it. I didn't even realize that that was the Pacers mascot was, uh, was Boomer. Yeah. Here's the Jump meter. And it is showtime here. Going high. All right. Not a good start. Fires it from long range. Fires there you go. Thank you. Reggie Miller's going to, Reggie Miller's going to help me out.
Yeah. Yeah. There we go, baby. Okay. They're acceptable. Ah, oh, fuck. Holy shit, we are fucking smoking now. Puts it back up. Nice. Four, three. How did he miss that shot? For three. Ah. Uh, Get fucked. Nice. Boom. Boom. Three points. Give me. Nice, nice, nice. Put it up. Put it up again. Oh. It's okay. <laughs> he knocks Reggie. Wow. He knocks Reggie Miller on his face. Poor Reggie. Except you can't bench a, a secret character. Nah. He clears his man out. Yeah, eat shit. Three points. With the finger roll, Indiana up by one. Puts it back up. He missed again. Deflected away. Get that shot out of here. Quick release. Nice. Fuck yeah, Reggie Miller. <laughs> God damn, he blocked like four of those shots. His blocking is like a pitiful little three. The fact that he's able to block so many of those. God damn, he was on fire. Why did I do that? I meant to hit pass. Oh, you fuck off. Jesus Christ. Wide open for the three. With 30 seconds to go. I'm going to say, how is that not goaltending? Again with the shot. Oh, How is that not goaltending? Did, did it actually work? I don't know if it did or not. Shit, I didn't get a shot off. I should have I should have got a shot off. I didn't realize it was how I didn't realize where the clock was. Yeah, it automatically picks Boomer, so you can't. Yeah. Can't can't bench him. Can't uh, can't bench. Uh... Yeah, and they're on fire. On fire. Nope. I guess goaltending is active still. I want to say it's a shoulder button is probably turbo. Yep, shoulder button's turbo. Oh! Way better now, huh? Now you can uh, now you can push people over too. Good job, good job. I can't, I can't have all the glory. Is 
Oh, why in the hell? I don't, yeah, I don't think we're winning this one. Uh, Pacers weren't exactly a good team. No. Cool looking mascot, though. Yeah. Uh, thoughts on NBA on NBC, NBA Showtime, Jason? Oh, uh, way better than the actual NBA Jam games that had been coming out. Yeah, at this point, NBA Jam was kind of a farce. You would think the NBA Jam games would have been this, and then NBA Showtime would have been what the NBA Jam games were. But no. But this is fun. That was fun. Uh, that was a lot of fun. Uh, scores out of 10, Jason. Seven. Uh, eight. Yes, I quite enjoyed that. Let's see what we're playing next. Uh, yeah, with no no dump cards, we have to play it. Well, Namco at Ridge least. Ridge Racer. It is, it is Ridge Racer. Yes, you are correct. What is this fucking Cowboy Bebop opening? <laughs> I, wonder, I, I could tell from the Namco right away. I wonder if, uh, wonder if Ridge Racer ever got, like, an anime. Uh, no, it never has. Would have fooled me by this opening. There it is. <laughs> All right. Let's go. I'll just go with the... That's what I was looking for. Oh, did you get the sound effect? It's Ridge Racer. Ridge Racer. Three. <laughs> Oh, dang. Okay. Meanwhile, at the time of this recording, uh, Ludwig Kaiser and uh, L.A. Knight are beating the shit out of each other in Germany. Nice. Oh, yeah, SmackDown is on there right now, isn't it? We're recording, yeah. we're recording this on August 30th. You're going to see this in, like, October. But we're recording this yeah. literally the night before WWE's Bash in Berlin. So, Bash in Berlin, welcome to Germany. Where nothing bad has ever happened. Ever. <laughs> Check the light. It's a new lap record. Oh wait, that was uh that was a uh, different game. Cuz that was uh that was the uh, episode 1 racer. Yeah. And we played that one. <laughs> yeah. I got to I got to say I was expecting it to be a lot shittier than this this game, I mean. I was expecting it to be a lot shittier than it is. It's, it's controlling the controls are very good. Oh, yeah, no. I, it's amazing, actually, that uh, we haven't seen a new Ridge Racer in, like, forever. Because, like, this is actually a rather uh, decent racing game. Is it, is like, it safe to say Is it safe to say this was the last one? Or the most uh, recent one? Or was there one on, like, a system I'm not sure of? I don't Ridge Racer... think there was one on the GameCube, but there might have been. The most recent one was, uh, the latest mainline game was Ridge Racer 7 in 2006. Okay. 
So that's way after this then. Well, not way after this. This was this was 2000. The, so that was on the PlayStation 3. Uh, the latest game was a mobile game spinoff, Ridge Racer Draw and Drift. Okay. Not sure about mobile games, but all right. Yeah. Finish first, though. Not too bad. Let's go to the next one. This is a really kicking soundtrack. Yeah, it is. Again, really shocking for uh, the N64. I mean, the more games have a good soundtrack on the N64, the less shocking it becomes. <laughs> True. I mean, because you couldn't fit as much on a cartridge, so you weren't expecting, like, CD-quality audio. True. I mean, somehow, uh, somehow Resident Evil 2 managed to get full motion video on, but yeah, by compressing it down to as low as they possibly could go. So, but they did. That that was witchcraft. Yeah, pretty sure somebody at Capcom sold their soul to the devil to make that one happen. <laughs> Maybe Umbrella Corporation made that game. I don't know. Yeah, maybe. Umbrella exists. For reals. Yeah. God, even the light trails coming off the uh, taillights. Yeah, that's that's pretty neat effect. Gotta say, this isn't as bad as I was expecting. It's not really bad at all, actually. It's a pretty competent game, actually. Yeah. The Ridge Racer games are, uh, you know, decent arcade racing games. Oh, we don't really see racing games like this anymore, unfortunately. You know, everybody wants to be the next Forza or Gran Turismo or you know, need for speed, unfortunately. And those games are good, don't get us wrong, but, like, when you've played one, you've played them all. No, nobody wants to be Burnout anymore, you know? Dude, Burnout was such a fucking great game. Oh, I freaking love Burnout. Burnout is so good. And it's a shame they don't make those anymore. Oh, you know, like, Burnout... Just the fact that we recently got a cruising game blows my mind. Which, yeah, that is incredible that we... Because the last one was, it was like fucking 20 years ago on the Game Boy Advance. Yeah. Now, first it was an arcade game. Then we actually got the port on the uh, Switch. In nice. fact, uh, it's uh, it's 20 bucks at Walmart. Yeah. I'll probably If I so, was going to buy it, I would buy it digitally, but yeah, that's neither here nor I'm, there. I, I'm just saying, like, 20 bucks is nothing to sneeze at when you get a physical copy. That's, and that's I mean, very uh, fair. So, uh, hell, Mario and Rabbids, 20 bucks, Walmart. Mario and Rabbids sequel, 20 bucks, Walmart. Physical copy. Like, that's pretty damn good for a physical copy for a Mario game. Right. All right, where's the leader? Na 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 leader. Na 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 leader. Not gonna quite beat. Not gonna quite be first place on that Close, one. Close, but second. Not bad. Oh, okay. So this is this is one of them games where you have to finish first. You have to get first. Yeah.
Damn, you really do feel like you're in the driver's seat. Yeah. It, it automatically starts you in first-person mode. I've been trying to turn it off. I, I only have two hands, though, and it's C up to change the view, so. Mm. I got one hand on the stick and the other hand on the button. Here, I'll do that real quick. There we go. Maybe that's like a default option you can change. Possibly. Out of my way, car. I mean, it makes sense. It's a racing game. If you were saying out of my way person, then it would be a little weird. Out of my way, albino, African, endangered rhino. <laughs> Turns out the uh, the driver has been taking drugs before before getting in the car. <laughs> Could be a problem. You piece of crap. Oh, this guy again. Yeah. Oh, no, not Spoiler. this guy again. <laughs> fart. <laughs> he is a fart. Yeah, I know, right? He's got his foot on the gas, gas, gas. All right, passed him again. Get behind me, Satan. <laughs> Okay, last lap. Make it your best. There's third place. Okay, two more cars to pass. I can I can see the uh, drifting of sorts going on too. Yeah, a little bit. Very uh. Very initial D. It's pretty smooth. Yeah. It controls pretty smoothly. There's the second place car. Apollo Cruz is tagging with Baron Corbin. What oh yeah, the they've hell? been a team for a bit now, but they've been like, you, it's blink and you miss it for him basically because. Like, you would have never known they were a team unless you randomly caught them tag-teaming together on on SmackDown or something. It's, it's weird. Wow. Yeah. Dang, you just barely missed the uh, person in first. Yeah, I know. This is a, this is a competent uh, racing game, arcade racing game. Yeah. Let's uh, give it one more go. All right, here we go. Three laps to go. Oh, shit. <laughs> Lane ends. Mm. 
Come on. Oh, for God's sakes. Get out of the way, damn it. Seventh place on lap one is not bad. Not bad at all. Making good headway. Even when you even when you collide with a barricade, it steers you into the right direction. That's <laughs> not that's a nice little feature. Yeah. It's like a course redirection. If you don't make the turn all the way. I like that. I appreciate it greatly. I'm not the greatest at driving games. Or racing games, I guess, as it were. Fourth place. Fourth place and only lap two, so I have a chance here. Just gotta catch up. There's third. All right, just got to pass two more cars in the next two lap. Two more. That was, a, yeah. that was a lap record for me. That was a good record, too. That was a good lap. All right, here we go. Third place. Let's get to second. Where's that dang second place car? Whoops. Oof. It's okay. Right there. Yep, I see it. Right. There's second. And there. second. Just gonna get the first. Oh, first there car, is. there he is, there he is. If I can make it to him. Oh, this is gonna be close. This is very close. There's first. Oh, oh, I just gotta, oh. I just gotta finish. I just gotta finish the race. I think I've done it. Final stretch. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Woo. Woo. Dang. Ah, uh, that felt good. So, uh, thoughts on Ridge Racer, Ridge Racer 64, Jason? It's a solid arcade racing game. Uh, you know. Namco really should uh, revisit the franchise, uh, you know, one day, hopefully. I absolutely agree. That was very smooth. It was easy to control. It wasn't frustrating. Uh, it's just it's an all-around really good racing game. Scores out of 10, Jason. Mm, eight. I will also give it an eight. Soundtrack's pretty kicking, too. Oh, man. I, 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 I just kind of want to sit behind the wheel at an arcade machine. Oh, thank God. Okay, I thought it almost landed on South Park Rally, but it actually landed on Kirby 64, which we played in a previous episode, so we get to re-roll re the wheel on that one. Respin. Actually, I'm going to make that an extra dump card, so if we land on a game we've already played. So now we have a dump card. Uh, oh, okay. This should be good. Oh, yeah, no, that is a uh, solid arcade game, actually. All right, Eurocom. <laughs> Ridge Racer. Wow, so we had three arcade games in one uh, go. Yeah. Not too bad. Okay, shoulder buttons are boost. God. Good God, Kiko, Kiko, Kaka, 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 Kaka,
Uh, oh, I gotta pick Damn the Torpedoes. Such so a chance for a Nintendo game to say Damn. <laughs> gotta finish in the top three. All right. All righty. So, uh, I like that the uh, arcade sequel to this uh, Arctic Thunder uh, had like an air conditioner built into it and would like blast you with like a fan while you were playing the game. Nice. I think the sequel of this came out on GameCube, did it not? Yeah. I was going to say, I believe I've played the GameCube one before. Wave Race also had one, a GameCube sequel. That was actually yeah. not bad. I think Wave Race 64 has had like eight different versions over the years, technically, because of uh, the uh, the rights to Kawasaki. I was going to say, yeah. And they, the they also re-released like a, they, the sh a Rumble Pack edition and shit like that. Yeah. Wait, wait, in, in all fairness, yeah, it did... All their all power to them because Wave Race is a fucking great game. So hell yeah. yes, we release it eight times. But I mean, until it's, Hydra it's Thunder came, those rights have. Uh, it's the fact that those rights expired several times. That's though. it's fair. But I'm like until until Hydra Thunder came along, there the Wave Race kind of had the market cornered on jet ski racing. Uh, jet Moto on the uh, oh. PlayStation. Oh right, but that didn't come out on N64. So right. I got a hell of a lot of boost. I waited till my boost was full to start using it. I felt like that was a prudent strategy. Yeah, also the Japanese version of uh, Wave Race featured... Uh, Rumble Pack. Uh, not only that, um, ads for Fanta Soda. <laughs> Don't you want a Fanta? Yeah. I gotta try the... Uh, Culver's has the... The Orange Fanta Float. And I gotta try me some of that. I went through the lava and it gave me nine seconds of boost. That's fucking sweet. Nice. Actually, it's funny because uh, one of the VTubers I follow uh, recently did a uh, hand cam video of uh, eating Culver's. Culver's is great, dude. Yeah. Whoa! Second place. Fuck yes. Not bad. Yep. Really good. <laughs> nice. You down with OPP? OPP? You down with OPP? Yeah, you know me. <laughs> Thunder, thunder Park. Thunder. Thunder Park. Thund oh. <laughs> I was going to say, Thunder, 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 Thunder scares them. The okay. Three, two, one. Go, go, go. Nice. I wonder what's replacing uh, SmackDown on Friday nights on Fox uh, come uh, September. <laughs> Probably college football or some shit. Probably. That's actually starting, like, next week. I believe. September 9th? Uh, I think it's September 13th they moved to uh, USA. I was under the impression it was September 9th, but could be. Uh, or whatever the first Saturday in September is, because this uh, that would be the sixth is okay. the first September. September thirteenth is the second. Okay, well, the new announced team on Raw starts this Monday. That's why I was figuring SmackDown was moving, yeah. moving to Friday this week or next week. So yeah, because because uh, McAfee's already back to his ESPN job. Yeah, he's he's back to. Uh, 
college game day. He'll be back in January yeah. for when Raw goes to Netflix. Yep. God damn, I launched that dude. I just noticed one of those signs says something about cheapo furniture. Yeah. Oh my god! Oh the my Bates lord! Bates Motel Management. Alright, I'm in second. Oh, I missed that boost. Shit. It's alright. Missed that one too. Alright, I'm out of boost. Second place is what I'm gonna have to settle for. Still not bad, because you gotta come in uh, top three in order yep. to uh, keep going, so. <laughs> Ashley said, fuck, I passed out. Oops, you broke it. <laughs> Guess you missed out, man. Oh, well. Uh, OPP, yeah, you know me. Second place, but first in overall time. Arctic Circle it is. Arctic Circle, let's go. Let's go. Damn the torpedoes. Damn the torpedoes. <laughs> Go, go, go! And then a guy comes on the radio and goes, Good start, because I got a speed boost at the beginning. Best time so far. Best time so far. Yeah. That guy. Wasn't able to get that boost. I will. Just give me a second. I'm going to fill it up first. Then I'm going to use it. There we go. Max. On ice? Yep. Oh, I hit this red one to give me nine seconds of boost. Boom! It's like I never used any boost at all. I'm not going to hit that, get that one, unfortunately. I think I'm back in the water again. Yeah, I think we're back in the water again. It's not shiny. What the fuck? That the big the big ship did the jump. The freaking frigate. Yeah. Like hey, I could do that too. Wee! It's a pirate ship, actually. It's yeah. got a skull and crossbones. At a boost. Yeah. Not for long. There's some more. There's some more boost. Whoa. Oh. There's some boost. It's up on a hill, though. I'm noticing that some of these shortcuts are actually not in the water. Yeah. That's what she said. Oh, oh just barely. 
That couldn't have been any closer than that. Uh, that should have opened the, the medium courses now. Yeah! Yeah! Greek Isles. I believe that also would have opened the medium boats. Yeah! Oh, I, I'm going to go Thresher. Let's do it. Let's go! Let's go! Medium top two to race hard tracks. Got it. I'm assuming in the hard tracks you have to finish first in order to open the bonuses. Probably. We're not going to get that far, but yeah, nice to know. This this is a solid game. It's such a good game, yeah. Nice. What? It's all Greek to me. Jesus. Fred Red Tom, Fred Red Tom, Mom Chicken Scooby Doo. Fred, Bernie, Tom Bosley. What? Tom Bosley. Get off of the fucking... Oh, my Lord. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Jesus! There was five of them. I don't know how to jump. Give me the boost. Yeah, buddy. There's another boost dead ahead. Nice. Time extended. Damn. Oh, I missed that boost. Shit. I'm wondering if, like, you know, the way to hop in this game would be one of those things where, like, you tap, like, the brake and then the gas or something like that. I don't think so. Uh, I'm just trying to think, because, like, I could have sworn that that's how you did something like that in the cruising games. Fourth. Damn it. Dang. Wow, the, the difficulty does jump up considerably. Yeah. It's still not bad. Uh, thoughts on Hydra Thunder, Jason? Solid, uh, solid arcade game. Like, I, I, I did enjoy this in arcades, and, uh, this is pretty fun on N64, too. Yeah, absolutely. It's a really, really solid racing game, jet ski racing game, like, rivals, white rivals wave race for, for really good jet ski racing games. Scores out of 10, Jason. Nine. Uh, Nine. On this episode, we played NBA Showtime, uh, Kirby, uh, Ridge Racer 64, and Hydro Thunder. Best game of the episode, Jason. Oh, dang. This is a freaking tough one. This is. Shit. Like, these are all solid arcade games. Um, I'm, I'm going to go with Hydro Thunder. Yeah, I think I got to pick Hydro Thunder as well. Although, NBA Showtime is a very, very close second. Thank you for yeah. joining us on this edition of Retro Roulette. If you like what we do, please hit subscribe. Be sure to hit the bell to be notified of upcoming videos. For Jason Amherst, I'm Mike Riley saying see you next time on Retro Roulette. Goodbye, everybody.